Okay, um, good morning everyone, this is Carl F. Rose, recording from Bedford, Pennsylvania, on um, oh, Wednesday, uh, uh, August 20, I don't have my phone here, uh, I'm live here, this is, uh, my internet sucks, I just had a tech out here, let's see, it's uh, t- uh, 28, um, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm using I'm using my new tablet that I just got, uh, which is a window. I have two tablets now. This one, as well as my. Uh, this is a uh, Windows 10 uh, operating uh, system tablet, and uh, actually, I'm kind of liking it. So I have a tab Android tablet, and I have um, uh, I have this uh, tablet. Here, uh, let me go turn off my other light. Here, this is cool because I can I can live stream right directly from my my uh, tablet, and um, I'm liking this act better than my um, uh, laptop uh, going live stream on, on my laptop uh, tablet. Um, so this is going to work. Um, uh, I can look at this, and I, you don't get too much of the alien eyes. I can I can look this way. You know, you're kind of looking up my nose, but uh, uh, but I I'll just have to figure this out. Um, uh, but I like. Um, let me turn the other light on. Hold on. Uh, okay, this is going to work. We're going to talk a little bit about that center. I have another file that I, I, I'm going to do something on my easy uh, video recorder a little later this morning. I'm going to kind of go more into it. Yeah, there we go. There we go. We got a better light here. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, so uh, anyway, uh, yeah, that's better. That's better. Um, uh, my finger there. Anyway, well, anyway, as, as you all know now, we've got the news. When I put down the news after I was done with my computer stuff yesterday, um, uh, uh, the uh, I don't even have. Anyway, uh, I, uh, yeah, I flipped down the news uh, yesterday, and the first thing I got was I heard that the Alliance cut uh, uh, Zach Zenner, and uh, I'm going to go more into it um, a little later on, my, on a on regular upload. I think it's uploading to Google Drive right now. I'm not sure. My other tap is, uh, is recharging, so... There's, there's a way I want to do it. I want to do it. Anyway, um, I was really upset at first, and then I thought about some things. Um, uh, with the uh, with what's going on with Andrew Luck, and, uh, oh, by the way, uh, if you're not subscribed and you like these kind of videos, uh, please be sure to uh, click on the subscribe link below and hit the bell notification. Um, because I did a podcast about the uh, uh, Andrew Luck situation, and um, I think all of this uh, has really uh, affected all the general GMs uh, throughout the league, which and which is a good thing. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So so uh, so the Lions are, are looking at that, and for the reason he was cut, I, I really like that Mark Thompson guy. He's a he's much bigger. And um, I think he's going to, uh, I'm pretty sure he's going to make the uh, uh, 53 man roster. I sure hope he does. Um, I really don't even want to see him on a practice squad. I want to see him uh, rotating in and out. So, but um, uh, I haven't seen other channels uh, mention this before. I mean, as I said, I like Zach Zenner, but uh, there he, he, areas where he was weakness was, was blocking. And uh, so apparently what I'm getting at is uh, the Lions are 
looking to protect uh, number nine, Matthew Stafford Moore. Um, put this thing off of my screen. Okay. Uh, um, and um, so, so what I'm getting at is, so, uh, so they're going to probably have a, a Thompson guy in, and because he is big, uh, he does produce so far what, what I've seen. Uh, and uh, I think they're going to save space. They're going to do one of two things. One, probably not not too likely because I don't think any team has done that. But the Lions have a really bad, um, really awful as far as the, uh, uh, as far as their backup quarter back situation goes. But I'm thinking that maybe they're, they're definitely going to have one of the quarterbacks in the uh, practice squad, but they might even be uh, have, hoping, uh, holding uh, space open for maybe two, possibly two, two backups. But that's highly li- unlikely. I think more than likely is they're going to they're, they're saving a space for an, uh, more depth at the offensive line, which makes a lot of sense. And I really hope this Bo oh, uh, Bo uh, Benchwa or whatever, however you pronounce his name. Um, from Wisconsin, I hope he makes. I'm pretty sure he's going to make the team. He's going to probably be on the practice squad. From what I understand, he needs a bit more work, but he's. Uh, I would prefer to see him on the actual 53 man team. I'd like to see him on the uh, in and out of the uh, rotations. Um, I am not a big fan of Crosby. Uh, I never liked Crosby from day one. I don't think he's that good, uh, uh, but who knows? Maybe they maybe they'll work him and uh, get him better. But I just I I've always had a problem with Crosby. But well, that's that's what we got to deal with. So that's what I'm that's what I'm getting at. I think that the reasoning is they're going to open up that space, have an extra uh, get an extra lineman for that that spot, and have more of a rotation. Which would, which would be absolutely what they need to do to make sure that Matthew Stafford stays healthy for the entire season. He can't go along getting 10, uh, 10 sacks. I never, ever, ever want to see a 10-sack game uh, uh, Stafford get sacked 10 times in a game again, ever. I hope that never, ever happens. And uh, for all those people uh, who were like me, who were, uh, wanted to dump Stafford, because... Uh, and I'll, and I'll call myself out on I was wrong on that for the longest time. I finally started uh, turning around in, in uh, 2017. But up until about 2016, I, I just wanted to uh, have alliances get rid of Stafford. Uh, but he's an Iron Man. But nobody, nobody can, uh, nobody can withstand uh, any more than uh, Matthew Stafford. Andrew Luck, if he would have been with the Lions uh, and, and had their pathetic coaching and pathetic uh, uh, players, uh, he would have lasted seven years in Detroit. He would have lasted like maybe three, and then he would have called it quit. Uh, I don't think Aaron Rodgers would have had the longevity. I don't think even Tom Brady would have had the longevity if he was uh, on the Lions. Uh, that's just how bad their, their situation was. So. Uh, what I'm getting at is it appears that Bob Quinn and Matt Tr- Patricia are finally, uh, finally uh, understanding uh, that they really need to do. Matthew Stafford needs more than just a uh, one running back and more than just one one wide wide receiver to throw to, you know, and have more than one person to run. But most importantly, he needs the, the wall. It doesn't matter what you do. Uh, who you have. If your offensive line sucks, your whole offense as a whole, you're not going to score points. You're going to lose games, period. Uh, anyway, uh, this was more of a uh, uh, live stream test on my new device. I like it. I like the way that... Uh, sorry, but I'm just holding this kind of on my lap and on my knee. I don't have my whole setup uh, yet this morning. Still got to get a shower. Just got done with the internet. Tech told me a lot of things. I'm not too happy about it. Uh, anyway, at least I got this stream off, uh, and uh, we will talk to you. Uh, we'll talk to you a little later because I'm going to do some more uploads. Okay. 
Okay. Alright, I'm still live. I need that. Okay. Oh, and it's pretty. 